everybody. I was still owing you some reviews. Um, I ordered something from Tesla. It was my first order and since then I have also a second order where I bought a bunch of things for myself and for um, like relatives also as gifts for the Christmas and uh, I just wanted to come back to you with a review of the products I have uh, tried out and um, I've been trying them out for almost two months so I can already say that uh, and I, I've been doing it diligently so I've been doing it every night so I will present you the evening skincare so to say and um, so regarding the cleansing I was uh, doing each evening cleansing, and I'm still doing until I, I finish the bottle. Cleansing with this AMPM. It's a uh, Happy M Day Flash Foam Wash, and I think I already presented this. It's a foam, and I was using it with this little rubber thingy and for the pores on the nose and you know I was just like rubbing it like so and washing my face and this was the first step the cleansing just washing it off so that's what I was doing and then at least once a week I was also using this uh, Laneige Multi Berry Yogurt Repair Pack. And this is in a bottle, in this beautiful pink bottle or can. And it's, it's really it's a beautiful design. And I, I just love the way it looks. And it's, it smells like awesome. It smells like unbelievable. I've used it up already, all of it. I still have some on the bottom. So I think I'm entitled to say an opinion about it. And my opinion was that it's perfect for people who um, don't really feel like having an evening skincare routine and are a little bit lazy and don't really feel like doing anything in the evening to uh, cleanse their skin. And this mask, is, it's actually a mask and it's a cleansing treatment. So it smells so good that it really motivates also people who are maybe not that keen on skincare to go ahead and do it at least once a week. Um, this was something new for me because up till now I was using like these uh, scrubby things to cleanse my face, like these with mini particles, like for example this uh, aloe scrub that had these you know these particles of, of scrubby these scrubby particles you know you can just scrub around and you know get the the dead cells this away. little Nash product was something new for me because it goes on your face like a cream so you apply it and it's like a cream and it's really hydrating your skin and um, I used it for example yesterday evening and in winter my skin needs to be so much more moisturized than in any other season that the this uh, treatment immediately sank into my skin so it really also um, nourishes your skin and it's also supposed to cleanse your skin I'm not really sure about the cleansing properties and how it purifies your skin uh, I haven't really observed many uh, a much of a difference between using it and not using it but I have observed that my skin got smoother so every time I used it the next morning I felt my, my skin was smoother and I didn't really need a lot of moisturizing afterwards because this treatment for me is something like hydrating and I don't know cleansing the cleansing part I, I didn't really feel much of a difference but it could be that it was just me who didn't observe it and it really cleansed my skin I've been having good skin lately so I, I haven't really been having any problems with my skin at the moment mm, I'm not sure if it's because of this or because of my more diligent cleansing each evening with the AMPM foam 
Oh, back to the, the smell. I also wanted to share with you that for me the smell is, is a bit funny. It's like a bit of cardboardish funny smell. I don't really like the smell of this foam, but uh, the cleansing property, I think it really, it really does cleanse the skin. And I like the texture, I like the foamy texture, how it goes on the skin, but I did repurchase it. I repurchased, I bought something similar, uh, a Japanese brand, but I will show it to you in a whole video or in a review video. I will let you know about that. But I like the foamy texture and I, I like it how it cleanses and uh, I might repurchase it I might repurchase it if the other one doesn't work for me. But um, yeah about the smell I'm not that sure. And the last step each evening uh, after the cleansing is um, of course hydrating, hydrating the eye area and hydrating the face. For hydrating the eye area I started using this Voom Green Tea Eye Gel. It's anti-bag firming and moisturizing. And it's in a little bottle like this. It's a Korean brand. And it's also from Sasa.com. But you know, the camera won't zoom, so whatever. And um, it's anti-bag firming and moisturizing. From these three, I can confirm that it is moisturizing. I'm not sure if it's anti-bag or firming because I don't really need firming in my eye area yet. And anti-bag, I don't really have bags under my eyes, but I do have dark circles for which this is not designed to work. But anyway, for that, um, I was using another product. So the for the under eye bags, I was uh, using this uh, Bright Up Nano Eye Mask. And I've seen it in a video, um, in Mr. Dizzy Bubbles' videos, and um, I thought I might try it out because it looked interesting and it says it eliminates dark circles and tightens the eyes up. Uh, I'm not sure about the dark circles if it eliminates, but it does hydrate your under eye area. There, there are like these two little patches inside and it's a little like you know these two patches that you put under your eyes and it's a really really moisturized uh, cotton pad sort of thing that you put under your eyes and you let it stay for a while. Mr. Mr. Dizzy Bubbles said she wasn't able to, th to do anything in the house when she had these pads on but for me I, it didn't really bother me if they were like a bit slipping down because I would push them up and then I would just do my thing around the house so it was okay for me from that point of view. Um, but I don't know if I don't know if anything in this world eliminates dark circles besides a good diet or um, I don't know I don't know what it could come from the inside also but from the outside also I'm not sure what can make dark circles go away and then um, I was moisturizing and I'm moisturizing my skin each evening with this the Herbe, the Herbe Moisturize Mo Moist Luxass Collagen Cream and I'm not too excited about this brand. I think it's like a drugstore brand in Korea or something like this but um, the writing text on it in English and then they say it's product of France but I'm not sure if it's product in France and I'm not sure about the collagen properties. The smell, it's uh, like a really discreet and really light scent. Mm. Besides having a softer skin, I don't really notice anything else. So it's not like super boosting, I don't know what. Uh, it's just uh, moisturizing and it probably has some collagen in it, which is good for your skin. So I won't repurchase this, I'm not too excited about it, but I will repurchase other collagen creams because I know it's good for the skin and as time goes by you have less and less collagen and you need it more and more from creams like this. So this was my review of the items I purchased from uh, sasa.com. Hope you enjoyed it and see you in my next video. Bye!
Ох, о, 